November 1975, short and English junior grade. Get ready for the dictation. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Start. My dear friends, it is always a pleasure to meet and address the new generation because in their minds and eyes there is hope for the future yet i find some difficulty in saying anything which will really be in tune with their thinking anyway i shall endeavor my best to say a few words to them i should in this connection offer my sincere thanks to you all for giving me this opportunity to meet you and give out a few thoughts of mine to you you all know the great struggle for freedom that we have launched it had its powerful effect on the men and women of my generation we have seen mighty changes in the world there have been world wars great revolutions and conflicts between rival political economic and social ideologies we have also seen something which is more important that is the tremendous advance made by science and technology in recent years which perhaps is the greatest revolution of all changes took place even in the past ages but the pace was relatively slow and man had time to adjust himself to the new conditions but in recent years the pace of change has been very fast and it has been difficult for men and women to adjust themselves in this fast changing situation they may make an external adjustment but the old style of life has gone and there is lack of harmony this is very well reflected in our political struggles and economic conflicts we try bring about a welfare state in india in countries where such a state has been established we see conditions which shock the older generation there are growing child offences and a rejection of even basic national culture while on the one side we see tremendous advance on the other we notice a disintegration of society in any event we cannot stop or reverse the current of change which science and technology have brought about in great parts of the world the question for us to consider is whether we can retain in this process some of the basic values to which humanity has attached great importance in the past and whether the spiritual element in life can be retained or whether it will disappear without that spiritual element i am afraid the disintegration of society will proceed in spite of all material advances thank you from velan and company to jail road salem to k7 and company for periyar street tutukurin sirs we are sorry to inform you that the goods sent to us last week have been received in an unsatisfactory condition the reason 
for the bad condition of the consignment may be due to careless packing also it may be that the harm was done by rough handling by the railways if the later was the case we are enclosing a list of articles which were broken or badly damaged in order that you may take up the matter with the railway administration to do so in the meantime we would like you to forward as soon as possible goods to replace those mentioned in the list our customers ask for speedy delivery so we hope that you will kindly give the matter your very early attention kindly acknowledge receipt of this letter hoping to hear from you yours faithfully